Hey there everyone, Hitesh here back again with another video and in this video I want to talk about some of the past updates like how it can be updates if it is from past but anyways uh, these are the few updates from the past some of the future plans as well as I have one book recommendation for all the people who are interested in machine learning or data science or a little bit related field so let's get started In the last few months, I was a little bit busy in working for a Hyderabad based startup and I would not even call them startup because although they are new in the market, but the technology on which they are working, it's pretty amazing. It's uh, mostly a business to business uh, service that they are planning to launch out very soon. But it was an amazing product and I happen to be a part of that team. Probably if they will ask me, I'll prepare a separate video for about explaining their product and stuff. But keeping that aside, it was an amazing journey. I learned a lot about machine learning, data science, and especially the recommender systems. And it was good payment, good experience, and all of that. Now, this brings us to the next topic, which is the book I want to recommend all of you. Now, it was most of all a recommender system that we were trying to implement as a part of my particular, uh, my particular job. And it was all amazing, but for that, I had to read a lot, just like everybody else, and there is no exception uh, about reading you have to buy a lot of books a lot of uh, online blogs articles so it has to be all the way now one of the book that i read during last few months was a recommender systems by charu agarwal i was completely blown away by the details and the way how this book was written and how much efforts has been uh, put up into this book and personally uh, i would always always recommend this book from now onwards anybody who is little bit interested in recommender systems or is interested in data science, machine learning, a little bit metrics manipulation using a variety of libraries, regardless you're working on Python or R, it doesn't really matter. The book is fully thorough and especially the examples about uh, identity matrix and all of that are pretty amazing, insanely crazy. The book also walks you through with variety of inside details and real world examples about how the recommendation should be built up and what you should take care about the privacy policies of the users and what you should be taking care about uh, the caveat points which should not be there in the recommender system. Absolutely love these few points. Uh, the only point that I would say that this book is a little bit onto the expensive side but hey, uh, author has done a really great job so respecting that I would say that yeah, it's a worthy buy and I would highly, highly recommend to buy this book. Now, the only point that I have about this book is if there could be a little bit more easier ex examples on this book, uh, it could have been like really the best book. Uh, but uh, anyways, uh, the examples that are already included in the books are pretty amazing, but I was expecting a little bit like onto the easier sides of the example so that it could have been easier to walk through into that complex example. But anyways, uh, I would say I'll leave a link in the description as well as on the screen if you are interested in buying a book or summers are coming up if you want to have a good read in your shelf uh, to read a little bit about that. I would also recommend the Kindle edition which is much cheaper as compared to that. Still the same content but a little bit lower price. So I would highly recommend to go through on the Kindle one uh, but anyways choice is totally yours. I'll leave the link in the description below if you are interested in recommender system or anything like that. Again, recommender systems by Charu Agarwal. The link is in the description. And again, this video is not sponsored by anybody, not even by Charu Agarwal or not by the book. I genuinely like it, so I thought I should recommend it. Now, this brings us to the next thing, which is what's coming up next. Now, in the last few days or months, I was amazingly busy in preparing a course as well as doing all this uh, work for this client. And now things are a little bit like, okay, I'm into the relaxed mode. Now, usually my days are planned up before what I'm, what the days are about to come and everything is planned so that I can just go through and without even thinking, I just keep on working. But now till the 15th of May, I don't have any much plan to do anything at all. So it's like a little bit free time for me and I don't want to be free. So what I have planned for the upcoming few days, now obviously I do have like a couple of travels in between that and also some of the family stuff will be going on in these few days till the 15th of May and I just wanted to get a little bit busy. So first thing that I'll be doing is I'll be focusing a little bit on my exercise routine and will try to get a little bit more into the shape. 
and the best thing that I would be doing is I would be starting a series on JavaScript on YouTube. This is going to be an amazing series and I am expecting that everybody is going to enjoy this series. But there are some points about the series which I cannot disclose right now. This is a surprise which is going to come up once we complete the series. This series is dedicated only and only to the regular subscriber of this channel and is going to be super helpful for you. Now there is a little bit of the catch here. Uh, the catch is not about anything at all. I'm just all I'm saying here is watch these videos regularly uh, as quickly as possible. You can do as of now. Follow me along in this entire series and within probably few days before I just catch up back onto my plan on 15th of May. We will be able to finish up this series on JavaScript and probably within a few days you will have an extra extra scale on JavaScript. So I think that's it. I don't have much other things to share. All of the things are already done. The things that are planned are going to be starting from 15th of May and that's the whole update. We're going to be starting a JavaScript series. The book ha I have already recommended to all of you and that's pretty much it. Be regular onto the series, watch the videos as quickly as you can and learn them as quickly as you can. And that's it. If you have enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button because a lot of videos are about to come on JavaScript. And I'm going to surely catch you up in the next video.